Well, here is the bathroom, essentially. You get up in the morning and we have a little kit and it has all the essential things that you need, like your toothbrush and toothpaste and brush. See how, see how much better the brush makes my hair look? <laughs> a lot of people ask about toothbrush and toothpaste. So luckily enough, toothpaste, you can do it upside right this way, is sticky and so it sticks to your toothbrush, no problem. It'll stick to your toothbrush and it will make a, whoop, a big bubble. I know that there's some questions about how to use the bathroom and how do you actually live in space like normal? Like at home, I mentioned real quickly about getting up in the morning and brushing your teeth and washing your face. Well, how do you do that? Well, here is the bathroom essentially. You get up in the morning and we have a little kit and it has all the essential things that you need, like your toothbrush and toothpaste and brush. See how, see how much better the brush makes my hair look? <laughs> I'm just joking. It still stands up straight. It doesn't matter where you are. It's always going to stand up straight while you're up in space. A lot of people ask about toothbrush and toothpaste. So luckily enough, toothpaste, you can do it upside right this way, is sticky. And so it sticks to your toothbrush. No problem. Another cool thing is that water sticks to your toothbrush too. If you can see it. I'll have some water come out. The water is pretty neat up in space. It'll stick to your toothbrush and it will make a, whoop, a big bubble. And that's just by surface tension. And then you can drink it. So a lot of people ask about what do you do with the toothpaste after you brush your teeth. Two options. Swallow it, and it's sort of like mouthwash, but it tastes a little gross. Or you can just spit it out in a paper towel, and then you don't have to worry about it. Swallowing thing I wouldn't recommend at home. I'm only up here for four months, so it's not that bad. <laughs> Don't miss out. Log on to oneindia.com for more updates.